This video is just a short extract from the entire course. If you wish to see all of the videos from this series at higher quality and in far larger screen size, head over to ifskills.com. We are now going to run through the whole process of creating a new Crystal Report from scratch, connecting to the data source, selecting the data object, placing the fields on the report. The first step is to choose Blank Report. As previously, two windows open, a blank report, which is behind the current window, and the database expert window. Should this window not open, or should you close it accidentally, by clicking Cancel or pressing Escape, you can revisit that window by selecting the database expert icon from the toolbar. We wish to create a new connection. We wish to create a new connection to an access database. I click the plus next to access slash Excel. I definitely want an access database. So in the top section, I can browse for that access database, which is our training database. And finish. This time I can expand out the views section because I know that it's a view object that I'm looking to locate. And I'm after the QRY full employee data. I double click on that. That object moves to the right. I can then click OK. In my field explorer, which is currently open, if however it were closed, I could use this icon at the top of the screen to reopen it. I'll expand out the database fields expand out the QRY full employee data. You will see that the page has not set itself up, so I need to go to File, Page Setup, select the No Printer option, and then set this for A4 Landscape. I've chosen Landscape this time because I want to place more of these fields onto the report than we have previously. Then I select the fields that I require, first name, surname, town, date of birth, salary, and gender. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six fields. Grab hold of any one of them, having let go of the control key, move my mouse across to the details section, as far to the left as possible, and let go. And I need to scroll a little bit left and right to see if it's fit them all on, and it has very easily. Let's put the department field in as well. So one click on department, and then a click and grab to move it across. I can then preview this report using the preview icon at the top of the screen and view the data. 99 records, first name, surname, town, city, date of birth, salary, gender and department. 